Okay, here's um, another advanced mission making tutorial. Here's an existing map which is called Gostaraya, which is an amazing, really an amazing map uh, for Armour 3. The only problem is that there are no roads. So part of my particular mission involves um, having to get from a specific point on the map to another point, which just happens to be 21 kilometers away. The problem is between the point that we initially start and that point uh, there are no roads and very rough terrain so uh, one of the options was to drop down some game logics and just simply remove various terrain objects like trees and bushes and in this case rocks uh, and um, this particular little script here just hides global objects for the nearest terrain objects to this object uh, and these are the objects that it hides within a radius of 50 meters. Um, and that kind of looks okay, but ideally I'd like to have a road because my con the concern that I have is that if people get go off this beaten track, so to speak, and they go up through the mountains, um, it's going to be really difficult to spawn in objects um, or, or enemy specifically uh, because the terrain is so rough that uh, in some cases uh, and quite mountainous the the um, you know there's so many different potential paths they could take through this terrain so to try and guide them I thought I'd put a road in and to do that is a lot more difficult than you can imagine because firstly try and find a path through this terrain and trust me I've driven through this terrain on a vehicle and the probability of you getting through in less than two hours or two and a half hours is very slim firstly because your vehicle is going to get damaged on a regular basis no matter how careful you are and if you drive really really slowly it's still going to take you two hours so you end up having to repair your vehicle all the time which is kind of interesting but also irritating so to put down the road roads uh, through this area and looked at cut terrains and there's some really nice textures that match this particular terrain this terrain this road texture is really just a, a gravel path and, uh, and you can say well that's all very well putting down a road but then how do you remove the map objects which obviously are going to obscure your uh, your ability to drive on this road so and also it doesn't look realistic obviously having huge trees and bushes in the middle of the path. So um, using the same process as I was using with the game logic, I just dropped that code into each of these objects. These objects will then obviously each hide and essentially cut a path through the bush and remove all the rocks and text and uh, other map objects to clear the road. And so essentially if I go back to the beginning and get onto my little quad bike and go and test it. And you'll see that it looks pretty realistic. And I don't think the average person's going to really notice um, that this road actually didn't exist in the original map, and it adds no additional overhead really in terms of processing. As you can see, the road is completely clear of bushes and trees and rocks and uh, if you position the road textures correctly you can follow the contour of the map and make it look pretty realistic so uh, I think clearing a 10 meter radius around each object is about the right solution so that it gives these essentially it gives you the impression that the that the road was or well, this path is um, designed and according to the terrain and the map specifics so uh, it's a bit rough but it is just a off-road path and uh, certainly makes driving through the bush a hell of a lot easy, easier so I hope that this is of some use to you and now for the next 20 kilometers 